gotta be M rated. Ride Michelin latitude. Spray the Mac like it's black magic. All black nigga with an attitude. Wristwatch full of ice cubes. Ziploc full of rabbit food. Rubber glove straight dog food like the pesto. We getting out too. YouTube, what it do, man? Y'all already know who I am. Man, man, ground hard checking in again with another video. And today, I got a difficult shot bass tutorial for y'all boys, right? Now, before I even get into this video, big, 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 big shout out to my comment section, right? I told y'all on yesterday on my last video, we was gonna help each other out. And if y'all needed any bad tutorial or you knew any easy methods, leave them in the comment section. And if I feel like we should make a video about them, I would, you feel me? So I'm gonna just show y'all what my homeboy K dot put in the comment section, all right? So listen. Big shout out to my comment section for this bad tutorial because it came straight from y'all, right? Now, I'm going to read the comment. K Dot said, yo, I'm about to put you on the difficult shot bass. Go to practice. Click to work on difficult shots. Go to the last drill on the bottom called reading the screen. Then run past the screen, but don't take the shot at the red mark. Instead, take an off dribble mid-range right before the free throw line. But be careful. Sometimes it make your player keep driving to the rack. If you have a high off dribble, you will make 8 to 10 shots per drill, which gives you 3K points. So if you could do that four times after each game you will get 12k at the east game it's crazy it's the easy way to get the bass in Berlin. anyone knows how to do it shout out to k dot everything he said in this comment was exactly how the drill was bro i went straight to practice as soon as i read the comment you feel me like i went and tried it out i went straight to practice clicked on difficult shot scrolled all the way down to the bottom clicked on reading screens and did exactly what he said and just like he said you gotta pay attention because sometimes if you go on, if you get too close to the free throw line, your player will drive in and it doesn't count. Right? And I noticed the more shots that you make, the higher the higher points you get. So if you missing a lot of them mid-range, you might get like end up getting like a thousand or twelve hundred. But if you making a lot, you're gonna get at least three thousand. Sometimes one time I got four thousand for the drill. You feel me? I hit 10 out of 10 shots. Big shout out to K Dot. Listen, like I said. I'm not gonna be the only person trying to find ways on this game because it's difficult, you know what I'm saying? We have to help each other. If you know any good methods, you feel me? Now, don't go steal somebody YouTube video and then come put it in the comment section, you know what I'm saying? Like, that, that ain't how we rocking over here. I'm not watching nobody else bad tutorial because I'm making my own, you feel me? Like, I'm looking for my own methods. So, don't go steal somebody else's video, put it in my comment section to have me making a video that somebody else already made. But shout out to K Dot, you feel me? Easy, 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 difficult shot bass tutorial. Now, I tried to do it. You know me, I'm always, I'm always trying something, right? I tried to see if I could get, if I could take floaters and it count. That shit don't count, but just take the mid range shots, off dribble shots. Now, dribble pull up. Find you a dribble pull up that you comfortable with, do this drill with, and I promise, bro, you will have a difficult shot in no time. Now, I seen my homeboy J.O. posted a video. I, now, I will leave a link to his video in the uh, description. He posted a way to, where you can do practices, unlimited practice, where you don't even have to play the game. You just, I leave a link. I'm not going to even go into depth on the video or what it was, but you don't even have to play my career games to go to practice. You can just keep doing the practice over and over and over again. With that method, you can get the badge really in no time. Really, after one game, if you're trying to get it on bronze, if you time your shot right, in one practice, you can get the drill. Because after you do the drill, just go over to the juice bar. You get one more. You get one more attribute. I mean, not one more. Attribute. You get one more practice, and you can just go right back in the practice facility and do the drill over again. Big shout out to K Dot. Big shout out to my comment section, bro. I want to have a positive comment section where we actually interact with each other and help each other out on the game. You feel me? So, look. That's all I got for y'all. Big shout out to KDOT one more time in my comment section, man. I'm rocking with y'all. If you new to the channel and it's your first time watching the video, make sure you leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you new. Man, man, ground hard checking up out of here, young nigga. The vet ho, get your dog shot You the type of nigga call the cops I'm shooting dice, then I brought my Glock Seen them lose their life and they taught me like Got a young freak with a tongue ring Make it disappear with a cough drop I was so geek, first shot a nigga with my pistol cock Heard my jaw lock Niggas talking like they Robocop Gotta know